this solidworks tutorial is about extend surface in solidworks and these are different options available in extend surface that i will be explaining in this tutorial so let's begin select part and click ok and here change the background to plain white and after that select top plane and click on sketch and after that select this center rectangle tool and make a rectangle at this origin like this and let me show you how you can enable the surfaces tab from here you can select this surface tab and this tab will get enabled and this is the extruded surface uh, tool guys just click on it and here extrude this surface up to 20 millimeter okay and after that we are going to make a sketch perpendicular to the previous one this is the right plane and select the sketch option simply make a line guys a horizontal line and i am just extruding this line just select here mid plane so that material get extruded in both directions like this and now i will explain you how to use this extend surface so select this tool extend surface select this edge and here we have different options available this is option for the distance and we need to specify distance by either dragging it or either specifying from here and check this box from here and that's how we use the distance tool now X select the extend surface again and this time I will be extending it up to surface so here we have the option for up to surface so we need to select the surface and then check this box from here and that's how we use this up to surface extend and now make a sketch on right plane select here a dot and exit the sketch now select the extend surface tool again select the surface and this time i'm going to uh, sorry this edge and i am i want to extrude it up to this point so that's how we use this up to point and check this box from here and now uh, we are left with two more options for that i am making quickly a three point arc and i will extrude it just like previous one so here is the option for extrude surface simply extrude it up to any number and uh, now enable the extend surface and here we have the option for same surface and linear surface so let me explain you the difference between them enable the linear one and here specify up to distance and or either you can drag it from here and here you can see the trajectory this is linear this is straight this is not following the trajectory guys and let me show you the other option select this edge and this time i am selecting the same surface and here you can see this will follow the same trajectory if we extend it it will follow the same trajectory so that's how we use the extend surface in solidworks guys thanks for watching